guys, welcome back. I'm just gonna do a quick video today with a plan with me. Um, my classes for college actually start back on Monday. So, decided that I'm gonna kinda go ahead and jump in and try to get this all decorated so I can just, first thing on Monday, just kinda put all the information in, in the little boxes and what I have due and etc. So, um, I originally had the pineapple um, student planner from Target, but I ended up switching it out for this one when Michaels had a sale a few weeks ago. Um, so I still have the purple disc from the pineapple planner, but I do have this student planner now inside, uh, which I love the colorations, the ombre from like the light pink to the purple. I, I just, I love it. So with this coloration, um, I'm going to be using some, I kind of get some beachy vibes, even though I know it is technically fall. Um, I wanted to do one last kind of beach spread. So I'm going to be using the new uh, small sticker pad from Mambi that is all mermaid and beach related. And then I'm also going to be using the beach vibe stickers from the accessory pack that they had at Joann's. Um, I currently take only two classes. I work full time and I only go to college uh, part time and this semester I'm doing it all online. Um, I'm actually have a math class which I'm not looking forward to um, and an intro to psychology class. So um, what I do and how I normally plan in my student planner is I mark off um, four boxes for my one class and then three boxes for the other. Um, and then I make each row a different subject. Like if I have notes to do, if I have a quiz to do, if I have um, an assignment that's you know not one of the, the other two. Um, and I do apologize, my dog has decided to come up here and start squeaking his toy. So if you hear that in the background, I'm sorry. Uh, he's a eight month old today, actually eight months old, uh, German Shepherd, German Shepherd Rottweiler mix, and he is just a ball of energy, and he's been sleeping all morning. So please forgive him. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and just start marking this off with some washi. I like to try to make it straight, but I know sometimes it's not perfect. Um, But this little divider just gives me a way to say, hey, this up top is for one class and the bottom is for another. And it just, it makes it really simple to keep it organized. I, I love, I try to be as organized as possible, but sometimes that doesn't always work. Um, but this is just the very thin uh, washi pack that I got from Joann's. It, it is made by Mambi, of course. Um, or I should say the Happy Planner. Um, it's on the Happy Planner aisle. And it's, uh, I think it was $4.99 for a pack of, I think, eight rolls. And it just comes in all different colors. And it's really, this one's more of a pastel color. And it's got a lot of pinks and a little bit of blue. And um, I do have another pack that is nothing but purple, which purple is one of my favorite colors. So... Uh, of course, I had to get the purple one. I'm just going to cut off the excess because I don't need this little flap here. So I just use my X-Acto knife to take that off. And I did go ahead and stick a few stickers on here. Um, just a, a back to school and a little coffee cup because we all know we need coffee the first day of school. Um, okay, so I'm going to flip through here and see. I think I'm going to put some coral down at the bottom. Now that I'm actually thinking about it, I'm probably going to pull 
pull this sticker up if I can. If not, it may just be stuck there. And I'm probably going to put this in the monthly view. So I did just kind of want to stick to kind of like a mermaid beachy theme for this spread. Okay, we did rip a little bit, but it is okay. A little bit of ripping is not going to ruin it. Okay. So I'm going to put the sticker that says, done adulting, let's be mermaids. And I'm going to stick that probably in round Wednesday, just because Wednesday is going to be halfway through the week and I'm probably going to be super tired, just because we've been off for a few weeks and yeah, got to get back in the swing of things. So we're probably gonna put one of these little mermaids down at the bottom as well with the coral. Okay, these little icons are adorable. So I'm gonna put just a few over here on the upcoming test because we always have like an introduction syllabus test for both of my classes. Um, so I'm just going to put those over there. I do try to keep my decorations on my student planner kind of minimal just due to the fact of, um, you know, I, had, I need a lot of room to write and just you know, room to to write down everything, and if something changes, I have room to kind of um, just to move it around if I need to. So I think I am going to put. I'm going to cover up the title over here that says "Weekend Adventure" with this "Weekend Adventure" just to make it match more and while I'm kind of just flipping through these books I'm actually gonna kind of introduce myself I realize I didn't do that in my in my original videos um, so I'm, I guess I should introduce myself. Um, my name's Amanda. I live in Tennessee. I'm right outside of Knoxville. Um, not a whole lot of planner people that I've met so far. I've definitely looked for them, but, um, I don't really find a lot of people in this area that are obsessed, obsessed as I am. Um, I, I started planning probably about a year ago and... Um, I've just, I've become crazy obsessed with it. Um, I didn't find anything else in there that I really wanted to put in here. So I am going to try this school mini sticker book that I found at Hobby Lobby the other day. Um, it just has some cute little student icons and maybe I can just throw some of these on there since it is all college related. Um, I know I do have some sections to read for my psychology class, so I'm going to put these little books here, and that will be my sections to read row. And there's some do stickers, so I think I'm going to stick with the kind of the pinks and purples. Actually, I'm going to do this teal to do and just stick it like uh, no I have some stuff to do on Tuesday so we'll stick it there and then we'll do maybe this hot pink color down for my psychology class on uh, stuff is due on Thursday stick that down there I 
actually think that's about it that I'm going to do, you guys. Like I said, I keep this planner very minimal. I don't do very much in my student planner just so I have enough room. So, um, I think we're good. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I know it was a very quick and simple video, but I will plan on doing more plan with me's in my classic planner and my mini social media planner here soon and maybe more student planners. Um, so hopefully you guys will like, subscribe, um, share, and I will see you next time. Take care. Happy planning. Bye.